بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم مائی ڈیو اسٹوڈنٹس السلام علیکم یو آر واچنگ میتھ از یاسر عرفات اینڈ وی ہیو اے سیکنڈ لیکچر آن ایکسرسائز ایٹ پوائنٹ تھری فار نائنتھ کلاس ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس ہاؤ ٹو فائنڈ آؤٹ دی سولوشن آف ایکسپونینشیل ٹائپ اکویژن سو فرسٹ وی ہیو ٹو ڈسکس واٹ از دی ایکسپونینشیل ٹائپ اکویژن سو ہیئر ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس یو فوکس ہیئر دس از ایکس پاور power is in constant form variable 2 if we have to write down this is 2 power x then it becomes exponential type function variable so this is 2 power x that means if a power it is in the form of variable that is called exponential variable or exponential function exponential equation exponential equation so here what was the rule to find out the solution of this type of exponential equation we have a very simple rule here first we have to separate x in single form with positive sign so let's start the question here this is 5 power x plus 1 we can write down 5 power x into 5 power 1 and this is because base are same then the power can be sum up to each other so therefore we can break this one 5 power x plus 1 like this so here this is 5 power 2 into 5 power minus x we can write down this on here this is 5 power 3 matlab 5 power 3 means 5 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5 5 5 is a 25 25 is a 125 so here this is plus x this is minus x so we have to shift this minus x here 5 power 2 means 25 and we have to shift this 5 power minus x here and this is 126 now what was the rule here to find the solution of exponential type equation first we have to make x single and in positive form now we can suppose this 5 power x it is equals to y and this is say equation number 1 so this is 5 remain same 5x 5y this is 25 over y because 5 power x it is equals to y and this is 126 so here there is no number means we have a 1 here so just take out the lcm here y multiplied by 5y that is 5y square 25 ones are 25 just take out the ordinary lcm here so this is y we have to shift to the right hand side 25 it is equals to 126y 126y write down in a standard form so this is 126y plus 25 equal to c now it becomes the quadratic equation here so quadratic equation we can apply the quadratic formula or we can find out at the middle term breaking method here so this is 5 multiplied by 25 it will be 125 so 125 125 minus 1 that is minus 126 Minus 125 multiplied by minus 1, minus 1, so it will be plus 125y. So we can write down in this form. So we have to break the middle term here. If, if dear students, you have any difficulty to break the middle term here, so just find out, apply the quadratic formula to find out the value of y here. That is a is 5, b is minus 126, and c is 25. You can apply the quadratic formula as well. Now 5y can be taken out the common here so this is y 5 we have to take out the common these are 2y we have taken out 1y common so this is the y yes 25 because we have to take out 5 common and y common there is no common that means y can be taken out common from anywhere minus 1 minus plus minus 25 equal to 0 so this is y minus 25 into 5 minus 1 equal to 0 y 25 y minus 25 all common here 
both factors are equal to 0 so 1 by 1 they will be equal to 0 and this is the value of y is equal to 25 and here 5 y is equal to 1 and y is equal to 1 over 5 this is the value of y so there are two values of y here one by one these values we have to put in equation number one to find out the value of x here so this is here one by one we have to put these values put y is equals to 25 in equation number one and equation number one is five power x that is equals to y 5 power x is equals to 25. This is 5 power x. 25 can be written 5 power 2. Bases are same. Then the power will be equal to each other. So the value of x it is equals to 2. So now put another value that is y is equals to 1 over 5. In equation number 1 again. So equation number 1 here uh, 5y x equals to y and this is 5 power x equals to 1 upon 5. So we can write down here like this 5x 5 power minus 1. We have to shift this 5 power denominator to the numerator so the sign of the power will be changed here. So again here dear students the base are same then the power will be equals to each other. So here this is the value of x is equals to minus 1 and this is the value of x is equal to 2. So our solution set is minus 1 and 